how would I, how do I increase my speed while maintaining my accuracy? I, because I, you know, it's one thing to, you know, that you're doing the practice and, and I guess not to freeze under pressure mm -hmm. and, you know, you know how you, sometimes you know what to do, but in the circumstance when you're under testing conditions, it's almost like being in a game and being trained to do something. And then sometimes it happens, sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. Things don't always work out and you have to figure out, and once again, how to keep forging ahead. So, yes, so I, yes, go ahead. So you said increasing speed while maintaining accuracy. Yes, because you, with the time constraints is very important. And um, with the LSAT flex, there's going to be three sections. So it's very important to do well, you know, on our three, you have three, that's it. It's not like you have double LR. So it's, it's not going to happen. Right. So each question is worth a little have, bit more. Yes. And that's, that's exactly what I'm trying to articulate. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So you, once, you, once the test starts, you've got to be ready to dive in. Okay. And keep moving forward. And we'll, we'll cover both sides of this, but the speed and the accuracy, they go hand in hand, right? Obviously, if you could slow down, your accuracy <laughs> could increase. But yes. how could you go fast while maintaining that? Part of that is what I call pattern recognition. Okay. The idea that when you come across a question, you've seen it before. You've seen it That's in a right. different disguise before. That's right. That's right. So That's right. I would encourage you, slow down for now. Take the time to thoroughly understand the patterns of reasoning so that when you come across it in the future, it's truly nothing new. Thanks for tuning into the show. Please subscribe if you haven't done so already to be notified of new episodes as I release them. And feel free to reach out if you need anything at all as you move forward with your prep. I'm happy to help however I can. In the meantime, I wish you all the best and take care.